worthy to gather to worship you this morning. We remember your deeds, O oh Lord. We remember how you woke us up every day up until this day. We remember how you saved us. We remember how you provided in spite of the economic downturn. Lord, you have been faithful in our midst. We have gathered to thank you. Lord, we ask for mercy. Any sin that will make us unworthy to worship you this morning. Father, we ask that you cleanse us with your blood. In the name of Jesus, we commit today's service unto you. We take authority over this territory. We announce in the atmosphere that this is the gathering of the first bonds. We take authority over our minds. We decree that our minds will not be traded in evil markets today. We decree that our minds are consecrated to the Lord. We decree that this territory is saturated with the presence of the Lord. There shall be no distractions in the name of Jesus. No exaltation of the self. We decree that everybody ministering today will speak as you have spoken, Lord. That every ministration will come straight from your throne. We come against, Lord, every Luciferian interference. We commit all the centers to you. We decree, Lord, that your will alone will be done. We ask that you accept our worship, Lord. May you come to you like a sweet smelling savour. Anything in us that will make this worship to be repelled by you, Lord, we ask for mercy. We decree, Lord, that we are covered by your blood. We decree, Lord, that our worship will come and be acceptable to you. That our time today will not be in vain. Worship the King is truly worship the King. Your name alone shall be exalted in our midst. We bring everybody to your feet this morning. We look above. We look at the mountain from where our help comes. For those who are on their way, Lord, we ask that you grant them journey mercies. We decree that the instruments will not disappoint us today. The generator will not disappoint us today. Flesh will not disappoint us today. We mortify every flesh and we ask that your spirit reign superior in this atmosphere. Lord, we give you all the glory. We give you all the worship. We give you all the adoration. Let the city be better because a group of women worshipped you today. Let our lives be better by virtue of this prayer. Let your name be hallowed forever. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. And we declare this service open in the name of God the Father, in the name of God the Son, and by the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Welcome to service. Somebody celebrate the Lord.
the plan for me. Lord, I'll set the plan for me. Oh, this I'm so. Oh, this I'm so.
Somebody open their mouth and just give him glory. Somebody worship this God that has kept us. The Lord that has prevailed against the enemy. The Lord that has prevailed against the things that are challenging us. Somebody just give God praise. Just give God praise. Worship him. Worship him. Worship him. Somebody love our God this morning. Say something nice to him. Hello God's name this morning. Hello God's name. Hello God's name. Father, there is none like you. Hallowed be your name, King of glory. Hallowed be your name, eternal rock of ages. Hallelujah, your name. The one who was and who is to come. The unchangeable changer. There is no one that can compare to your master's worth. We give you glory, Lord. We give you glory, Lord. We give you glory, Lord. Somebody bow at the feet of God this morning. Somebody bow. Bow and worship him. Bow and worship him. Bow and worship him. Bow and worship him. He deserves all our praise. He deserves all our worship. Ah, like that one leper, <laughs> we have returned. Like that one leper, we have returned. I want somebody to just close your eyes and give him thanks for the wondrous things he has done. Oh, you have traveled. You came back and the Lord preserved you. Thank God for our apostle. She has been on the road on the road <laughs> if somebody said she's been meeting herself on the road on the road thank god for them thank god for preserving her for taking the gospel to everywhere she's taking the gospel to she's didn't go there to make sure the lord took her and brought her back thank god for yourself as you went and came back the lord kept you thank god for us for pastor Ibi for bringing her back thank god for all our pastors indeed the lord has been good thank god that whenever this door is opened that we are here that we are here we, we have never opened this door and we came there's nobody it's something to thank god thank god for wwp thank god for wwp like wildfire is spreading is spreading father we give you all the glory for in jesus name we are worship good morning everyone our online viewers good morning have you greeted your neighbor it's worship the king series 23 this is the 23rd one the 21st one, like joke, like joke, 23rd series. Somebody appreciate God and greet your neighbor. Say something nice. They took their time to thank that girl. They took their time to dress up. Pastor, you are looking good. Pastor Ivy, you are looking good. Pastor Fa, you are looking wonderful. Appreciate somebody. He said everything will gather to give him glory. Father, we give you glory. Hallelujah. Jeremiah chapter 13, verse 19. He said, then out of them shall proceed thanksgiving, given. And the voice of those who make merry, I will multiply them. Did you hear that? The voice of those who make merry, I will do what? I will multiply them and they shall not diminish. I will also glorify them and they shall not be small. We have come to testify. As we dance and we testify, the Bible says we will not be small. He will multiply our testimonies. Every time we testify, the pastor will say, let the Lord multiply. Let the um, testimony bread testimonies in our lives. That's that scripture. That's where that thing is taken from. Praise the Lord. This morning we have a lot of people that have come to testify God in this our special service of worship the King. Somebody put your hands together and clap unto the Lord. All you will do this morning is to clap for Him and shout when there is time for you to clap, to shout. Praise the Lord. Sister Ivy, Asemi Kara, please come forward for your testimony. Sister Okwazo Divine, I have come to return. All the glory to God for saving my mom from stroke. Somebody clap unto the Lord. She fell down in the room. A nurse examined her and said her BP was high. I prayed and told God that nothing my mom. She slept. Are you hearing me? She slept and woke up hell and hurty. Secondly, her visa to Germany has been approved. See what the devil was fighting. See what the devil was fighting. I give all the glory to God. Hallelujah. Somebody clap unto the Lord. Please come here. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 
I've come to judge God faithful this morning. I've come to worship him for all that he has been doing in my life and in the life of my family. I, those that know me know I have a sister that has been trusting God for years. She got married in 2014 and we have been trusting God. In fact, they, they, they even told her that IVF was not an option because she had some toxic fluids in her ovaries that even if she does the IVF, it will not be successful. So we kept trusting God. I remember in 2019 when my mom passed, she cried. She was like, my mom did not even get to see her grandchildren. And I remember that year, mom, you called for a seed. Then the altar was that side for um, the rug for the, um, this place. And I came out, you know, then I just buried my mom. I didn't have anything. But when I came out, I came out in feet. And before I left the fellowship that day, I got that money to pay. And there was something that God did very strikingly. You know, when we came out, initially it was supposed to be rogue. But when I stood there, I said, God, I wish this thing would be tiled so that in case maybe rain comes and all of that. And before that evening, it was, turned, it was changed to tiles. And I said, God, this is a confirmation that you will do it. On the 14th of February, against all odds, we did everything we could. She has done several IVFs, they failed. But last year, she did an IVF and it was successful. On the 13th of February, when we were in fellowship here, they called me. Pastor, oh, I'm grateful to God for your gift on that day. You know, I don't take anything you do here for granted. They called me on that day. She was in labor. I went outside after the worship, and I, the husband told me she was in labor. And the next day, I was there because she stays in Kefi. I've been bringing her here. I bring her here all the time. And on that 14th of February, by 9.45, my sister gave birth to a baby girl. Hallelujah! After nine years. This year is supposed to make it ten years of their marriage. God came true. He showed us his boundless love in that month of February. Can the woman thank the Lord? This his is our testimony. His love has no bounds. And I've come to say, Father Lord, I am grateful Hallelujah. because you did this one. And Hallelujah. I'm not taking it for granted. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! Praise the Lord. Sister Koye, please come forward for your testimony as Sister Tochi get ready after her. Sister Helen, I'm thanking God for, saf for safety of my children throughout this term. You know, they've returned. Some of them are returning from school and for provision and good health. I have come, I'm very grateful to God. Somebody clap unto the Lord. Sister Helen, I have come to return all the glory to God for my elder brother, son, who left home for almost a year. He has returned home like the prodigal son, but at least he has returned. <laughs> I keyed into a testimony apostle shared last year and prayed for her. I prayed for, I prayed for God to bring him back home safely. He showed up in my house one night and I encouraged him to go back home. He was now re, re, he's now reunited with his family. Hallelujah! Lastly, I am thanking God also for the gift of a new car from my husband. We are saying that loudly. If you are trusting God for a new car, shout. Hallelujah. I'm here to judge God faithful. I'm here to return all the glory to this, my father who has been faithful. I came here depressed. I was as, as if I couldn't go on with life. But I met mommy. And mommy prayed for me and here am I, I'm growing from strength to strength by his grace. I also want to thank God. Um, so, um, last year, my husband applied for a job. Now, he, usually when you apply for a job, you're shortlisted for interview. So he wasn't shortlisted for the interview. So the person who God was using, who was a mouthpiece for him in the organization, told them, no, they should go back and check that list. There is, they should still check the list. And they checked the list and he was shortlisted. Now, after he was shortlisted, he was now called on for the interview. Now, after the interview, he was the first candidate to be interviewed. But I told him, I said, because you're the first candidate, you'll be the one to be chosen. So after the interview, we waited one week, two weeks, which was taking long for the results to come out. And the same voice that God was using, we got an information that he was a preferred candidate. And during that time, during uh, the midday prayer crew, mommy prophesied and said, there's somebody here, your husband. God has said, leave the matter, I will help him. 
that was in that period. So when the person inside now was not asking my husband, have you gotten the offer letter? He said he has not seen it. So he now called the organization. And then the HR now said that, ah, that they've contacted the person and the person had even acknowledged, which is supposed to be my husband. My husband said he has not seen anything. He checked the mail, checked the mail, he didn't say anything. So the person now called the people. I don't know what he told them, but the, the long and short was it. He finally got the job. Hallelujah. Then lastly, I want to thank God for my son. On Saturday, I came back home and I saw my son's leg burnt. That um, hot swallow poured on his leg. And the bone was a little, it was, it was severe. He poured on his leg and in the process of trying to, because of the heat, he was now trying to remove, use his hand to take away the swallow, his hand also got burned. But I'm here to thank God that God intervened and Hallelujah. it was no more than what we just praise the Father, Lord. Father, thank you for that intervention. We are grateful for that miracle. For that miracle. Obey the words of the prophet and what will happen. You will prosper. Hallelujah. Sister Tochi, please come forward for your testimony. Please hurry up. Sister Gladys, thanking God for saving my husband from an accident a few days after he bought a new car. Hmm. Then the, the car security fell and crashing, crashing through my neighbor's gate and fell down and crashed into my neighbor's gate. Thank God no one was behind the gate. No school children around at that time. I am also thanking God for sending me help after a long time. I do not take it for granted. Father, we are grateful. Somebody clap unto the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I want to thank Apostle for teaching us how to pray in and out of season. And to sum up my testimony, 124, Psalm 124, 6 and 7, it says, Bless the Lord who had not given us as a prey to their fate. Our soul is escaped as a bird out of the snail of the fowlers. The snail is broken and we are escaped. I want to thank God because I have a car that I've driven for two years and this car has a tiny bulge and um, the mechanic said it's fine, that um, there's no problem. So what they did was they moved the tire, the particular tire to the back. And on Monday, um, the 25th, I was at home and they had called me to say they, they want to change the particular tire. And I had given them you know, permission to take the car. And all of a sudden, I heard a bang. It was an explosion. And before then, the previous day, I woke up restless around 2 a.m. And I was led to go to my children's you know, bedroom. And I was just praying. I didn't know why I was praying. I was praying like a mad woman. I was going everywhere. And immediately, I heard that bang. I, I started looking for them. They were all with me. By the time we went out, the young man was just about to enter the car. And the tire exploded. And by the time... I checked the date. That day was my 25th wedding anniversary. The devil wanted to give me, you know, something to deal with, negative news on the day of my wedding anniversary. I've come to return all the glory to God that consistently, you know, help. Even when we're not aware that he's protecting us, he's always mindful of us. May his name alone be praised forever and ever. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Father, we thank you. Because it did not allow her sister to see shame. On her day of congratulation, it was not done to shame. Father, we are grateful. Hallelujah. Pastor Fa, please come forward. Sister Stella, I am grateful to God for sending me here from, from Zion. From strange places towards the end of January. Just as I was contemplating buying food stuff for my home, I received loads of food stuff from my husband's mentee. Again in March, I receive another set of food stuff. Food stuff is a big thing now. You are not clapping. You never buy one bag of rice. So people are doing and see food stuff. Um, you know, clap onto the Lord so that the food stuff will reach you too. Abba, I receive another set of food stuff without paying a dime. This period has been a financially challenging period for me. But God has been faithful. I am grateful for, to God for all this provision. We give God all the glory. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. I have come to bless the name of the Lord, the immortal God, the invisible, the only wise God, the one that loved us with an everlasting love, 
the one that drew us near with his loving kindness, the one that accepted us in the beloved. I have come to return honor, glory, and adoration to his name for adding another year. And for me, for me, the month of March is not for me alone. It is for my elder brother, it is for my daughter, it is for my nieces, two of them, and I'm the one that closes it in, in March. And so I have come to return all the glory, all the honor, all the praises. We are the second generation of Christians in my house, and our children are the third generation. I don't want to take it for granted. Everybody in my house is saved. Ah, I am grateful. And so I am grateful for the gift of life that we have opportunity to love him for what he has done for us. I have come to appreciate Apostle. I am grateful, Ma. You know now. You know. You know, no be public thing. I am grateful. I am grateful, Pastor Ivy. I know where you are, but in spite of that, God bless you. Pastor Bibi, you know, I am grateful. Auntie Ulo, thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you, online people. I am grateful. I am being celebrated. I have been celebrated. It's no longer news. Anytime March comes, it comes so fearful for me because I know there's a lot of sacrifices that goes from the people to God on my behalf. And I have come to return all the glory to God to say, Lord, I am grateful. I want to thank God for Pastor O. I want to say thank you for this mandate that is upon my life. I want to thank you for the platform. I want to thank you for the resources. I want to thank you for everything. I am grateful. The gift of God in my life has found expression in this place. And from this place, I have become a celebration in my own church. They have celebrated me. They are celebrating me. Everybody from the least to the greatest just because I have a platform that fires the gift of God in my life. And so I am grateful. God bless you all. Thank you for loving God through me like you do. I am blessed. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for the gift of life. That is a testimony. You know, I remember the, when we came early, early when, when we met pray, Pastor, all will tell us that he has, she's empowering us to go back to our churches to make impact. That is a testimony. I don't know some of you are not making an impact anywhere. She has given us platform to go back and make impact and bring people. He says she's called to the saved who has missed their way. So he's, he's, he's helping us, empowering us. So when you go back, you need to do what you have to do. Praise the Lord. Sister Etuma. Thanking God for breaking of pattern in my husband's life and family. No one has ever crossed the 50 years age. That, that boundary, no one has crossed it. <laughs> to the glory of God, my husband has just clocked 50. Nobody has passed it in their family. Did you hear that pattern? Thank you, Lord, for, this, you know, for destroying the evil pattern. I return all the glory to God, Pastor Ivy. Sister Ruth. I am thanking God for a safe journey to and fro Kaduna last week. Father, I am grateful. Anytime we go and return, we have to give God all the glory. Say the ransom of the Lord shall do what they shall return. It's a testimony until you travel and you are not able to return. You will not understand. Yesterday, my get was telling me that I saw him when I came back. He was moody. I said, what happened? That the mother was going from um, Ibado to Benue. As he was just arriving in Benue, she, she, she died on the spot. So whenever we travel and come back, let's not take it for granted. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Why are we so cold? Is God not good to us? He's good. God is good to Hallelujah. us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I have come to say thank you to this God who remains faithful. He's a good God. I judge him faithful. Amen. I want to thank God particularly for Johnny Mercies. In February, we were privileged to travel and I had to stay back. 
I thank God for the opportunity. I thank God for that trip. I thank God particularly for my daughter. I, I was just amazed at the woman, the young lady she's becoming by the day. I stayed with her. I mean, me, I stayed with them in their apartment. I was sleeping with her on her bed. So we were there for like, you know, together. And I've seen my daughter evolve. I've seen my daughter mature. I've seen her love the Lord much more. I've seen her hunger for God. I am grateful. I don't take that for granted because... They're in a society where there's a lot of chaos, madness, mental health issues. But every time she opens her mouth, you just see joy bubbling from the inside, which I know that it can only be God. It can only be God. And I have come deliberately this morning to say, Father, I am grateful. That which you have begun with her, may it continue. That thing she has found, may it continue in the name of Jesus. I also want to thank God on behalf of my father was a journey of 89 years but for us so my parents were in this white garment church for well over 40 years 45 years and we all it was the journey we all started in but the Lord showed us mercy and was plucking us out one by one there's nothing we did nothing we didn't do trying to get him saved but but we kept praying to cut the long story short two weeks to my dad's demise he was led to Christ. Hallelujah. He wasn't just led to Christ. He responded in a manner that we knew it could only be God. When they said he was ill, my sister came and said, Daddy, this is it. Prayed with him. And apparently he'd been studying the daily manna. He says, ah, this book is, she said, that daily manna well over the years was preparing his heart. And we didn't know. But two weeks when he fell ill briefly, he, he accepted the Lordship of Christ. He renounced every other name. He renounced every other God. He accepted Christ as Lord and Savior. He says, I am asking that you come into my life. I'm asking that you be the Lord of my life. After 45 years, I have come to say, God, we are grateful in the grief, in the pain. It's painful for me. But I've come to say, Lord, that is the greatest. For me, that is the greatest. Because he could have died physically and, of course, been cut off completely. But God did not allow that to be our testimony. Today, we are confident. We can say for a shorty that he's with the Father in heaven. I have come to say thank you to this God who did not allow our pain and sorrow to be very miserable. We have come celebrating life, 89 years of God's mercies, God's faithfulness, God's goodness, good health, strength clarity of mind, focus, a responsible father, a loving father, a good father, my own father. I have come to say thank you to God. The one who taught us how to marry our spouses. I've come to say God has done us well. Lord, I return all the praise. I return all the honor to you in the name of Jesus. I want to thank God for the comfort of the Holy Spirit. Indeed, the Holy Spirit is our comforter. The messages I got in this period say, ah, Pastor Ibi, you loved your dad. Oh, Pastor Ibi, and then I don't, I now saw the video at my 50th birthday. Ah, but God is faithful. I'm grateful for strength. I'm grateful for the comfort of the Holy Spirit. Dr. I want to say thank you. Apostle, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. She's been there. Thank you for the prayers, for the encouragement. It's been up and down, but God is faithful. Please just help me thank God one more time on behalf of my family. Hallelujah. Let's rise up on our feet and thank God. I know you, we all have our testimonies. We all have our testimonies, even if you didn't come out to share. Somebody close your eyes and remember that one thing God did in this month of worship the King. And just raise up your hand up to heaven and just say, Father, thank you. Thank you for the gift of life. Like I said, thank you for Apostle has been traveling. You know, it's not her making. It's not because she has the power. She flies and she comes back. She goes by road. The Lord brought her back just to take the gospel. Thank you for your family. Thank you for your children, for every testimony shared. Like we said, testimony will birth testimonies in our lives in the name of Jesus. Father, we are grateful. We are not ungrateful women. We are not ungrateful women. We are forever grateful for every little thing that you've done. For every prophecy that you bring, brought into accomplishment. Father, we are grateful. Father, we give you all the glory. Blessed be your name, my Father. We cover every testimony with the power that is the name of Jesus. And declare that the enemy will not come up with any represent attack in the name of Jesus. Father, we give you all the glory. For in Jesus' master's name we are praying. Please, let's welcome Pastor Offer as he leads us to pray for Nigeria. 
Let's clap unto the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody bless the name of the Lord on behalf of our nation, Nigeria. Give him the glory that is due his name. Is a woman opening her mouth and blessing the name of Jesus. Jesus, we give you praise. Jesus, we give you glory. Jesus, we exalt you. We adore you. We magnify you on behalf of our nation. We say thank you. Great are you and greatly to be praised. From the north to the south, from the east to the west, we say thank you. Thank you, Abba Father, in Jesus' name. This morning, like Jehoshaphat and the Israelites, in Second Chronicles chapter... Hallelujah. In Second Chronicles chapter 20 and in verse 12, it says, Oh, our God, will you not judge them? For we have no power against this great multitude that is coming against us. Nor do we know what to do, but our eyes are upon you. And in verse 17, he told them, he said, you will not need to fight in this battle. Position yourselves. Stand still and see the salvation of the Lord. Who is with you, O Nigeria, and all the states in Nigeria. Do not fear or be dismayed. Today, go out against them. For the Lord is with you and, Jeho and Nigerians. And everybody all around the world that desire a miracle in this season, bow their head with their face on the ground. And all when women pray and their families in Abuja and beyond, bowed before the Lord, worshiping the Lord. We're going to worship the Lord like the Israelites. God gave them an instruction and said they should position themselves. They are not the ones to fight this battle. And in verse 22, the Bible says, Now when they began to sing and to praise, the Lord set ambush against the people of um, our enemies all around the globe who had come against the people. And they were defeated. And so we're going to look at Psalm 136. And I'm going to read it and you will follow me. I'm going to say the first one and you will do the second one. Which says, for his mercies endures forever. Hallelujah. Oh, give thanks to the Lord. He, for he is good. Oh, give thanks to the God of gods. Oh, give thanks to the Lord of lords. To him who alone does great wonders. To whom by wisdom made the heavens. To him who laid out the earth above the waters. To him who made great light. The sun to rule by day. The moon and the stars to rule by night. To him who struck Egypt in their firstborn and brought out Israel among them with a strong hand and with an outstretched arm. To him who divided the Red Sea into two and made Israel pass through the midst of it. But overthrew Pharaoh and his army in the Red Sea. To him who led his people through the wilderness. To him who struck down great kings. And, still, and slew famous kings. Sihon king of the Amorites. And all king of Bashan. And gave their land as a heritage. A heritage to the people in Nigeria. His servants who remembered us in our lowly state and rescued us from our enemies, who gives food to all flesh. Verse 26 together. Oh, give thanks to the God of heaven for his mercies endures forever. 
Somebody begin to pray in the spirit. Makusa la bazagada balegede iya kata la gada balagada balikata elo koto koto lobo elegede gede. And in the same vein, we are praying for the apostle. Leka sakata kata kala bada eleke tekete Psalm sixty verse twelve. True God, you will do valiantly, for it is He who shall tread down your enemies. Makusa la bazagada ba eleke tekete eleke tekete iya gada la gada ga elo godo 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 ah because your mercies endures forever. True our God, your daughter will do valiantly, for it is you that will tread down her enemies. Ela kasa katalaga eloko to logo dogo ilaga daga daga la bada. Everything that represents an enemy, eloko sokoto spiritually and physically. Maliga daba la kata kalaga eloko to koloko to elege degede. Begin to declare it over your. Server, hello, God, oh God, oh God, oh, yeah, God, oh God, oh, that through our God, I offer a life who will do valiantly. Ah, for it is God that will tread down my enemies. Makusa la bazagada, eleke teke teke li badagada, makanda la batu kalaba, eloko toko to, eloko toko to, eleke deke de, iya gada gada, eloko soko to. We will run through. Troops, we will live over walls. Mali gada gada. We are not of them that draw back unto perdition. We are of them that believe it to the saving of our soul. Ella kosokoto, ella gede gede, iya gada gada, ella koto koto. Our enemies are defeated, for His mercies endures forever. Hallelujah. Our memory verse. Psalm 29 and verse 2. Ella kusalaba zagadaba. Psalm 29 verse 2. Let's go together. Give unto the Lord the glory due to his name. Worship the Lord in the beauty of his holiness. Once more. Psalm 29 verse 2. Give unto the Lord the glory due to his name. Worship the Lord in the beauty of his holiness. Hallelujah. You may be seated. Media. Child of God, in Romans chapter 12 verse 1, he says, I beseech you therefore, brethren, that by the mercies of God, that you present your bodies a living sacrifice holy child of god there's something called holy god is holy and he expects he expects you to be holy there are some words that come out of your mouth that are not holy there are some attitude you portray they are not holy all those besetting sins it's time for you to cut it off cut it off he expects you to be holy when you are wearing that dress what do you have in mind what is your aim child of God, God says, be holy for I am holy. And then he says, acceptable to God. Have you asked him if he's acceptable or you are just, you are just pushing it to him like this, like as if he's a hungry dog, like take, take, take it. He said, if I'm your father, where's my honor? Where's my worship? You honor men more than me. Where's my worship? It's a lifestyle of worship. Child of God, I'm telling you the truth. Even if you have to be walking like this, even if you have to drive in traffic, and be careful that's a lifestyle of worship a lifestyle is not in the morning i wake up i pray after i pray i can behave anyhow no 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 no. i cannot behave anyhow he says acceptable to god and what is that sacrifice a living is a, a the living he say which is your reasonable service reasonable that means if there is a reasonable service there's an unreasonable service there's some services you give there's some departments in when women pray that should go and repent go and repent Hands. Leaders, hear me and hear me well because some of you have started doing this work as a routine. God wants you to do it as sacrifice, He wants you to do it as connected to Him. When you are doing it, be seeing God in the whole matter. Do it and see God, and you will see God will honor you. He says, I honor those that honor me, those that do not honor me, I esteemed. Seriously.
Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. It's worship the King. It's worship the King. It's worship the King. It's worship the King. It's that time of the year we forget about everything and concentrate on God. Praise the Lord. Let me not go ahead of myself. Lord, we worship you. Thank you, Jesus. Pastor Law reminded us this is the 23rd series in Worship the King. Wow, thank you, Jesus. For indeed, who are we that you are mindful that you, you expect from us worship? Exodus 15 says, Then Moses and the people of Israel sang the song unto the Lord. They said, I will sing unto the Lord for he has triumphed gloriously and is, he has hauled both horses and riders into the sea. The Lord is our strength and the Lord has become our song for he has given unto us victory upon victory. This is our God and we will praise him. Our father's God and we are mandated to exalt him. The Lord God is a warrior. Ha. Yahweh is his name. Pharaoh's chariots and army. He had all into the sea. The finest of Pharaoh's officers had drowned into the Red Sea for the sake of his people. Your right hand, O God, is glorious in power. Your right hand, O God, smashes the enemy. In the greatness of your majesty, you overthrow those who rise against you. You unleash your blazing fury to consume them all like straw. At the blast of your breath, the waters piled up like wall. I will consume them. I will flash my sword and my powerful hand will destroy them. But you, God, you blew with your breath. And the sea covered them. They sank like lead in mighty waters. For who is like unto you, O God? I'm sure we borrowed some people here. I'm speaking Chinese. You don't understand. Your story is not like this story. <laughs> but we are grateful. We are grateful to God that we have a God who is warrior, loving but warrior, who goes to war on our behalf. Half of the wars that we have had to fight, we didn't know how the victory came. That's the kind of God that was served. Psalm 63 says, Oh God, my, f oh God, the God of my life, I am love sick for you in this weary wilderness. I test with the deepest longing to love you more with cravings in my heart that cannot be described. Such yearning grips my soul for you, my God. I'm energized every time I enter your heavenly sanctuary to seek you, to seek your power more and more. I drink in more of your glory for your tender mercy, for your tender mercies <laughs> for your tender mercies mean more to me more than life itself how I love and praise you oh God and daily I will worship you passionately passionately can every woman stand can every woman stand can every woman stand yesterday pastor told us that we have been summoned we have been summoned by God since we are doing the things we like since since we have begun to live our life like God does not exist God has summoned us and I tell you WWP International in the year 2024 every time we will be summoned you will not know but you will be summoned and I'm so grateful for the pastor that we have that whenever that signal comes she can hear to summon us we have been summoned and when you are summoned by a cabiosi, the first thing you do is to bow. The first thing you do, woman, where is your passion? Woman, where is your passion? WWP International, where is your passion? We have become too hard for God. He cannot penetrate us. But I pray 
today that as worship begins that your heart will be broken and you will become soft because beyond everything God created the reason why he decided to create you again was times like this the woman with the alabaster box she didn't care what was happening we are women that have experienced the mercy of God why do we behave like we do not know what mercy is why the things you have had who you have become why are you suddenly behaving that it was your strength it was your father's name or why 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 in this generation when God is looking for people to worship you are the first person woman you are the first you are the first that should appear before your king whether he summons you or not every day you wake up you, you, you just bow to him there's something within you that propels you to bow because you know you know the things he had done for you how he had broken protocols for you certain things that he had done if it had not been God who was on your side why are you forgetting so soon is it because rice is now 100,000 why why are you forgetting so soon why 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 let's lift up our hands Eshana we have been summoned again by God we have been summoned and when you are summoned the first thing to do is bow in reckless abandon hey! I worship you in the beauty of holiness for who is like unto you oh my God who is like unto you I wish that a woman would begin to break her alabaster box and tell the Lord, tell the Holy Spirit, give me strength to worship my God. I need strength. I need strength. I need strength to worship my God. It's an abomination that God will come into a sea of women and not find worship. Oba tofi mo le shosho.
glory. Pour out your power and love as we sing. Holy, 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 holy. As we sing, holy, holy, holy. I want to see. an ir irresponsible lover God God is not an irresponsible lover he doesn't come to you if you don't yearn for him <laughs> God is not irresponsible he will not force himself on you he needs to see that you want him as much as he wants you like pastor said it's not to just it's not to just throw something at him it's so important that whatever we are ready to give him today that he's eager to accept but if God is not eager to accept it's because you have not given yourself oh. I want to see I want to see I want to see Open the eyes of my heart, Lord. Open the eyes of my heart. I have to see you. Let every distraction step aside. Please turn to your neighbor. And if the person is not properly seated, can you tell the person, properly sit, we are worshiping the Lord. I see some people sitting down and crossing their leg. I need you to help me. Turn to your neighbor and say, Pastor is saying you should properly sit. We are before Elohim. You, we are before Elohim. We are before Elohim. We are before Adonai, the, the one who owns your life. So I forbid you to sit like you're in your father's parlor. I have to see you. I have to see. In this generation, it's a struggle. It's a struggle to focus on God. It's a struggle. You have to deliberately. You have to deliberately desire the Lord. Because so many things are calling your attention. And if you forget yourself before you know, you are cursing God. Open my spirit. Open our spirit, Lord. May we give you worship due to you. I have to see you. I must see you. Jesus, Jesus. Holy moment when God walks in on us, every case is on the lion and the lamb. This is holy moment. on the lion and the lion. when the glory comes there'll be no words to say oh, oh, oh.
of waters because you have to be part of this worship I forbid anyone to just mope and just look at that the spirit of God will consume you and it will lead you to your path like streams of water when the glory comes nothing will do will matter we will be slain before him ah, we are in that season oh Lord come when the glory comes Generation needs to see a glimpse of the glory of God. Hey, now my son, my people don't know no more. And they my name and nobody see my part on the name. I said, because the glory must appear. That's the only way some wickedness can be silenced. And they may no more, no more, no more share this. I open my spirit to you, Holy Spirit of the Living God. Spirit of the Living God, have the right of way. We give a command now. Everything, everything, elements and creation bow and align to this that what is about to happen. We give you all the glory in the name of Jesus. So we declare worship the King 2024 March open in the name of God the Father, in the name of God the Son, and by the power of the Holy Ghost, taking us further into worship. For a few minutes, we welcome. Precious Arawa Jesu, put your hands together. Don't be carried away. Be plugged in. Oh, 
the king. Worship your God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's the car owner of um, Honda Pilot. K-L-O-L 757-TC. I don't know the color, but Honda Pilot. Please, your attention is needed outside. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. He has done marvelous, he has done marvelous. Please praise the Lord. He has done marvelous, he has done marvelous. Please praise the Lord. 
Elohim. Isaka Elohim. Isaka Elohim. Reka suta leke bradosa. This morning, Saka Elohim means to bow down before Elohim. But beyond bowing your heads, bowing down to God, you need to bow your hearts. Can we just rise upon our feet and begin to Shaka Elohim? Shaka Elohim! Yahweh Sabaoth Yahweh Show you. 
of your heart is drawn to you it, you pull him by your pure worship one more time join heaven and say Hosanna in the highest wow of a truth for who are we member towns that this God this God this God taking us further into worship don't don't just don't just be looking register your own Shifra is one of our own in the house this is our first time put your hands together and welcome Nina Kanu she leads us into the next Shabbat Eboshitaha Ebenon Oboshiti Eza Namata Dalabado Shekete Eza Dabada Balades Kezekete Ribaka Dabada Desh Kezekete Eza Leke Pedosh Kezekete Masi Kiziri Vigidish Hallelujah what is worship without your total submission what is worship without first offering yourself as a living sacrifice you are words molded into a human being you have come to worship the king what is your offering God. I came with my offering Hallelujah. Habakkuk 2 verse 14 and the earth will be filled with the knowledge of the glory of our God as the waters covers the sea this is my offering lift up your voice and begin to pray in the language you have not come to watch an entertainment you have come to give all the worship to our king of kings somebody reach deep down begin to magnify him let your spirit be in alignment My defender, supporter. Oh, Lua. Oh, Lua. Ah, so far, I be okay. I have told Sana. My worship is to you. My life and offering. I lay it at your feet. Let me hear you sing. Oluwa. 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 Atofarati. Atofarati. Hey, 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 hey. Atofarati. And I'm a seabird. Oluwa. Arapatena. Oluwa. You know that must say Hana. My worship is singing. My life and offering. I lay it at your feet. Oh, Lua! Oh, 
Messianus. We worship Adonai. In a normal synony. We worship Adonai. El Kiba. El Elyon. Yahweh. We worship you. A son of Nepetia. A man of Nepetulu Putoka. Yet again we are summoned. In a patrol sapade. One of the things Apostle told us yesterday, she said, Whenever you are summoned, it's because God has seen your future and needs to do something. But I tell you, before He begins to do, you must give Him what you owe Him. In by mercy, we are summoned. <laughs> by mercy we are summoned for generations to come and there are certain things that God could not do in the generation of your father and your mother but because of you and generation after you will explain and be grateful for the well of worship that you were able to dig and nipi nipu shunova ha 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 and lepe neko tushin so we hey so we worship so we hey most high mountain ha ha we hey we worship that's all we have that's all you need we hey most high most high God, we hail in 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 We worship, 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 worship. We hail most high. Huh. For some of us, this is our prayer. Do, do not let us go in the form and posture that we came. Do not let us go. Some of us are still struggling with the Spirit of God. Do not let us go, Jesus. Do not let us go. Oh, Jesus. Taking us further, is, we call our Oziama in the house. She's still a man. She's still one of us. But outside, she's called Esther Jonathan. Put your hands together. Worship God. Thank you so much, Mommy. I'm so grateful for the privilege. Thank you to the entire leadership of One Women Pray. I'm so honored. Thank you so much. A woman ready to worship, just lift your hands and magnify the name of the Lord. <laughs> Lift your voice, raise your sound of worship. From the rising of the sun to the setting of the sun, your name is to be hallowed. Feel this room with your worship. the voices sing it to him say Yeah! 
Raise your voice and worship.
sing it. The most beautiful. Worship him in truth and in spirit.
in this house you keep your promises sure and your covenant Yahweh. can I hear you sing it Revelations 4 11 Who is like unto thee among the gods? Who is like unto thee, O God? Among the gods, who is like you? You who is glorious in holiness. Come on, repeat it. And fearful in praise. Hallelujah. Lift up your hands of worship to the one who is Adonai. Sarebanai Kappa. We raise you up. I worship you with reckless abandon. Come on, lift your worship all the way at the back. Open up your mouth and worship Yahweh. Release your worship. Because you have it in your belly. Keep your lovely face ever before my eyes. This is my prayer. Make it my strong desire that in my seed. worship is this ever before my eyes this is my prayer lift your hands up to him make it my strong desire that it To keep your lovely face ever before my eyes. This is my prayer. Sometimes it gets so hard, but make it my strong desire that in my
And I see Jesus. He seated on the throne. Yeah. I see Jesus. He seated on the throne. I see angels ascending everywhere.
that's your place. That's your place, Jesus. Jehovah. We bow, we bow, 
we bow before your throne let it flow 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 oh let it flow let it flow because this generation must know that some some abnormal women passed and that we have dug some wells that they cannot resist so let it flow na 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 no no i wish that someone will join me and dig those wells never never no 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 that your children will not be able to resist this God this God that we have come to know this God that we have come to love this God that we have come to worship that our children and the generation coming will not be able to resist him let it flow let it flow out of your belly will flow rivers of living let it flow let it flow let it flow let it flow Oh, let it flow. There must be something stronger than this generation. And this is how we did the well. Let it flow. In a mini, mini, sure. Let it flow. Let it flow. Let it flow. We, are, we have shown these children beautiful things. We have told this generation that if you have something stronger than God, you can ignore God. Huh? Uh -huh. And we see your children and my children love those things. Other than they love the Lord, they, they cannot see themselves bow to Elohim because of the things that we have exposed to them. Ashanaha, your child cannot be bound to stand in front of his face and say, I love Jesus. And there is nothing you can do. Even if I try not to love him, there is a river within me. It's finding expression through me. So let it flow. Let it flow. It's good to give them the beautiful things of this world. But when they see a well, may they not be able to resist when they come in contact with God. Let it flow. Let it flow. Yes, take them to the best of schools. Yes, give them what your money can afford. Whatever you do, may God not look for the next generation coming. When you pass this year, something must flow from your inside. Something even you cannot control. Let it flow. Let it flow. Let it flow. Oh, let it flow. Don't be tired of worship. We are bringing another vessel. She has come to help us. She came. We, she came to help us. To get into some dimensions. That after this worship the king. Our lives cannot. Even if it tries. Cannot remain the same. I have watched her. From 19, uh, 2020. I have seen her from a far place. And today, Dr. Goma, it's my honor to welcome you. Come and worship your father. Worship your God. She has many titles. I will not even spoil it. But she has come to worship her father. And your father. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Apostle. I love you, I celebrate you, and I honor what God is doing through you in this generation. Thank you so much. Ma. Can we celebrate our apostle? Can you do it deliberately? Can you honor her in this moment? Can you celebrate her for me? Thank you so much, Ma. Thank you so much, Ma. Thank you for the honor and the privilege to be here. Are you ready? I know we've had a lot of people here, so you don't need to get tired at this moment. Can you tell your neighbor there is more? There is still more worship to be released. Can we just lift up our hands in this room and bless him? May it be a sweet, sweet sound in your ears. It's not
not a song, it's a prayer. May it be a sweet, sweet sound. I love you, Lord. And I lift my voice to worship you. Oh, my soul, rejoice. Worship the King, oh glorious above. Yes, yes, sir. Oh, gratefully sing of His power and His love. A shield and defender, the ancient of days, pavilion in splendor and garden. The team is, oh, worship the King. Oh, glorious above, oh, gratefully sing of his power and his love. He is a shield and defender, the ancient of days, pavilion to his land and guarded. Oh, tell of his might, oh, sing of his grace. Whose clothes is the light, whose candle is this, his chariots of wrath, the deep thunder clouds fall, and dark is his part in the wings. Oh, Thank you, 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 thank you,
his holy name Do I have worshippers in this room Sing like
let us sing. Power and majesty. Power. Mountains bow down. Mountains. They bow down at the seas. And the seas will roar. At the sound of your name. Of your name. Of your name. Of your name. I sing for joy. I sing for joy. All of the days of my life, ah, you will find me here. Ah, be here when it's good, when it's easy, when it isn't easy. Hands, lifting hands, even when it isn't easy, even when it isn't easy, even when it is easy. I am the sacrifice. Yes, yes, yes. I have more than a song. Today, today, I brought myself. Hey, I am your worship. Hey, so receive this living sacrifice. I am, I am, I am, I am your worship, I am your 
If you do not know what to say, you can tell him thank you, thank you. But let your spirit, let the spirit of God express something your natural mind will not be able to express. We worship Lion and the Lamb, we praise you. We worship you. We worship you, Adonai. We worship you, Elohim. We worship you, Elohim. We have seen the dimension of you and we cannot be still for our eyes have seen what we cannot explain. And so we bow. We bow. We bow. We worship you. We worship you. We refuse to give your place to another. We recognize who you are, what you have done, and we worship. Hey, we worship you. Father, you can trust us with your heart. We are a generation of women hungry for you, desperate for you. And let every other thing be silent, but we refuse to be silent. For we have seen within our country. What the Lord, what the Lord, what the Lord has done. If it had not been Jesus who was on our side, when they rose up, different things. But we remain covered in his glory. And so we bow. We join 24 elders. We join angels we 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 cast our crown and we worship you for this is the real essence of man thank you thank you Jesus thank you for going all the way so that we can enjoy today thank you Ah. 
and going further another vessel that the Lord has prepared to come and help us show us a dimension Ushaba Ebuka you are one of the the vessel that will spoil principalities in this generation Ebuka you are one of those vessels that will spoil principalities I don't care how strong they are we are hopeful because of you that our generation your generation will be compelled they will be compelled to worship God so welcome with me God's servant Ebuka songs a patu shupaha a leketo simanakato we worship your Jesus blessed be your name oh God lift up your hands to Jesus everywhere you can just pray in the Holy Ghost everywhere thank you so much Apostle for the privilege I'm so honored worship Jesus everywhere I didn't come with songs I only came to raise sounds that we were journeying to worship together so as I begin to raise sounds coming out from my spirit, I ask that you pray in the Holy Ghost, whichever posture you want to take, but you cannot leave this place the same way. In the next two minutes, I want you to raise your voice everywhere in this house unto heaven and begin to pray in the Holy Spirit. Let heaven hear your voice this, this minute, oh God of heaven. Generation that seek your face. Go for your society, the belly. Rokatas Kabilia Fatile. Kokatas Kabila Puria Kapapata. Apriakas Kotatila. Koprakatas Kepriatele. Koprakatas Kiprakatakabe. Forget the person beside you this minute and just pray in the Holy Ghost. Koprakatakaboa. You will not know where the energy will come from. There is a spirit in a man that quickens the man. He that same spirit that raised Jesus from the grave. If it dwells in you, it will quicken your mortal bodies. Everywhere in this place, oh women, oh women, oh women, cobra katas, cobra kata, oh mothers, oh shablas, kaboa. Tell me no one to 
você When the glory comes, no word to say. And the man of mercy, who brings the bread, when the glory comes, show me no word to say. There'll be no word to say. Any man a moshe man. You are righteous. You are righteous. I feel his angels walking everywhere already. I feel his angels from the back to the front. You are righteous. It's a it's a time of encounter. You are righteous. You are holy. You are holy. You are holy. You are holy. We join the twenty-four elders to say you are holy. You are holy. You are holy. Messiah, you are holy. You are holy. Holy, you are holy, oh, holy, oh. You are holy, holy. You are holy, oh, holy, oh, holy, oh. You are holy, oh, holy, oh. oh Papa, the shepherd at the car. When you are here, you are here, you are here. When you are here, you are here, you are here, you are here, when 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 you are here, you are here.
have to pray. For all men not always to pray and not to faint. The same pattern. The same pattern killed the father. The same pattern killed the mother. The same pattern is already chasing the children. And you don't want to pray. In their family, nobody has ever married. In their family, nobody has ever bought a car. They will allow you to go to school, allow you to finish university. But when you graduate, you will look like somebody who hasn't entered school before. And you don't want to pray. Some of you, they will allow you to marry, but no children. No issue. 20 years of marriage, no child. And you don't want to pray.
expression of his countenance was altered. I saw an angel with something like a mighty rod this middle I saw him there and he placed it at the back of somebody stretch out your hands everybody here Jesus bring the sound down angels of God I know you are here you are here to perform angelic miracles whosoever is that person now every sickness or weakness in that body as we shout Jesus seven times again and I dropped the mic I saw the angel I saw him with a mighty rod I'm seeing him at that, at that place can we just close our eyes and we shout Jesus seven times for what I saw in the scripture, he said that the mention of his name, every knee shall bow and every tongue must confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. We will prophetically shout Jesus seven times. I've seen it done it before, he will do it again. I see him at that, just that place. Close to your hand, touch that person. This minute, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, can your hand, can your hand touch? Shout Jesus seven times. That's him. Seven times we will shout him. Are you ready? Without the drum, the last one, that's when you will hear the drum. We will raise the sound. The last one. Just the piano. The last seven, we will hit every sound. And we'll see what's going to happen here. Are you ready? At the count of three. Everybody will shout Jesus seven times. One, two, go. Jesus. Two. Jesus. You want him to touch six, seven. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Yes, yes, yes. That's him. That's him. Jesus, help them. Jesus, help them. Jesus, help them. Keep praying in tongues quickly. Keta para ra ba koshata ya bahara. Elegede bo koshata ya bahata. Legra ba do koso tori bahada ya. Legede bo koshata ya bahosa. Ega ra ba kose tele bo. Rakata la ba koshe dele bo sa. Somebody lift up your voice. Come on, pray, pray, pray. Don't get tired of praying. Something is breaking, something is breaking, something is breaking, something is breaking, something is breaking. Somebody release your brother, release your sister. Come on, this is the hour. Father, we break every chain. We break every stagnation. 
we break every power from your foundation that has been speaking this is the hour to speak it's a kairos time if you keep silence it's your fault open your mouth and begin to speak now. open the prison door and begin to release them one after the other there's someone that has been healed of a chronic pain a chronic pain has ended now in this meeting that pain has ended you will no more live on medicine again in the name of jesus I see wombs opening. Wombs are opening. Wombs are opening. Wombs are opening. Wombs are opening. Rapid and ever pushing. Passes are breaking. Passes are breaking. Parental causes are breaking. That cost that was put on you by your mother. That cost that was put on you by your father. I see it breaking. I see it breaking. Listen, in the realm of the spirit, I saw something. It was for singles. I saw like a prison yard where they are gathered singles, old and young, divorced and widowed, all packed in one place, a tight prison. And while we were praying in tongues, the door was open. Mashaka Patosa. Come out of them. Come out of them. Come out of them. Mashaka This is your season. This is your season. When you worship him, the ammonites will be destroyed. Every pen had is destroyed. Somebody begin to come and bring out your children. Call your son's name. Call your daughter's name. Bring them out of that prison. In the mighty name of Jesus. Silence the voice of the devourer. In the mighty name of Jesus. Lake up a naha, eke up a ria naha ta, e shata la bakoria na handa, e gadali bakoso tolebo, e shakata la bakoria naha. Hey, somebody pray, pray, pray. Ira gadabo shata ya bakoso tolebo. No more. Whether it be from your foundation, whether it be from your mother's house or your father's house, whether your mother cost you, whether your father cost you. The Bible says, and Moses came and said, let Reuben leave. Ha, ah, let Reuben leave. And let his seed not be few. Today is the day of breaking causes. Any kind of cause. Whether it be legal. Whether it be legal. Masoko poka shata ha. Ege dele brako tosia ha. Enda labako sete leba. Daddy do it. Oh, the do from the hardest ones. In the mighty name of Jesus, let wombs open, let doors open, let financial doors open. In the mighty name of Jesus, rekete le bakusa taya, enda la bakusa taya da haya. Any power that has pursued you till now, they have met their Waterloo. In the name of Jesus, any evil letter in circulation that has your name on it, we arrest that letter. In the name of Jesus, every character assassin, we arrest that letter. In the name of Jesus, everyone that says you will not stand, anyone that says that it will not happen for you, let it be silenced. In the name of Jesus, it is being silenced right now. I say be silenced, be silenced, be silenced, be silenced. Be silenced. Let the blood of Jesus begin to speak for you. Let the blood of Jesus begin to announce you. Let the blood of begin Jesus begin to open the doors for you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Lift up your two hands and begin to say, I'm covered. Cover yourself, cover your sister. Begin to call your name, your family names. Everybody in your family, covered in the blood of Jesus. Makata labako sete. Oh, lagabado sekete leboko shataha. Mendele boko suyaha. Manta labako shete libaha. In Jesus name we have prayed. Amen. Something happened to me this morning. Early in the morning. So it's a few minutes past 2 a.m. 
and I jumped up from my bed and I said every storm be silenced let that storm be silenced in the name of Jesus it was actually a black storm I had to go and start looking for the scripture where Jesus said peace be still there was a serious storm dark storm coming on the land and I shouted peace in the name of Jesus open your mouth clap your hands and begin to declare peace to every storm every darkened storm black storm hey somebody take it seriously take it seriously let a particular family take it seriously hey we silence every storm we silence every storm every negative storm coming on earth every storm that is blowing blow your boat blow your family blowing your finances blow your health blow your vehicle blow your plane the aircraft the sea the boat somebody stop that accident stop that accident it will not happen that accident will not happen somebody open your mouth say it say it it will not take place remember the lord has told me he's proactive open your mouth and begin to speak now that accident will not take place in the mighty name of jesus nobody in your family will die of accident in the mighty name of jesus that chest pain that chest pain somebody as if you were hit on the chest as if they blew you on the chest I command peace to be still in the name of Jesus you were coughing blood I command that blood to cease in the name of Jesus thank you Abba Father thank you Jesus. lift up your hands and begin to worship him thank you Jesus worship him worship him Lift up your hands. She might Oh, 
simiri na ruari no to talk in am ahi adino ya ana fufaka ana nyaga kana zuruki e kana zuruki baba mi mo o mo ma to binu wa na bwipere na cha Take an offering for the Lord. Were you blessed today? Were you blessed by this wonderful man of God? Ebuka, I don't know what adjective to use and describe you. But just make a promise here that you are going to come back because I've booked you down again. That was powerful. That was powerful. Help me celebrate this man of God. And help me celebrate Dr. Ugoma. A wonderful woman of God. I just love her so much. She is the minstrel of Pastor Jerry Eze. And she is powerful. I've been watching her just like you said for a long time. I give God all the glory for her life. Please help me celebrate her again. Celebrate our own Nina. Our own Ozioma. Our own Raquel. And can you help me celebrate our own patience, Tumba? Can you help me celebrate this frontline DC? Jesus and with a Jesus joy help me celebrate I will call her the convener of worship the king Pastor Biobele Arasa the Lord will honor you Amen. the Lord will honor you Biobele the Lord will honor you he will keep blessing you and increasing you as you worship him he will elongate your life in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, God. In Jesus' name. Amen. We were celebrating Pastor uh, Dr. Ogoma. I'm calling you Pastor already. <laughs> Help me celebrate her again. <laughs> I just love this woman of God. God will continue to honor you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Take an offering. Take an offering. A good offering. Today is Thanksgiving. There are a few people that are doing Thanksgiving. If you are among them, shout. Okay. God showed you mercy in the month of March. You're going to be celebrating. Call all your friends, you will celebrate. Is that okay? But let's just do our offering. We're going to take it very fast. Who is doing offering? All right. Stand up with your offering. Lift it up and just begin to say, Lord, I thank you. For this, I thank you. There's one song I used to love. For this I praise your name. Oh, no, no, no. For this I praise your name. With all my heart. For this I praise your name. For all that you have done. For this I praise your name. With all my heart has begun go ahead and give your offerings while you're standing the lord bless you as you do that continue the things that are impossible
impossible to think that money can not Sorry, buy. sorry, can I sing one song? Is that okay? Yes. Finally. <laughs> okay, sing. The Lord has done it finally. Finally, finally. The Lord has done it finally. Finally, finally. I said the Lord has done it finally. Come on. Finally, finally. Somebody. The Lord has done it finally. Oh. Finally, finally. I said the Lord has done it finally. Finally, finally. finally. The Lord has done it all. Finally, finally. The Lord has done it finally. 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 Finally, finally. Doctor, come and come and sing for us. Finally, finally.
What a cat, I'm gonna worry be me. Be a worry be me. What a cat, I'm gonna worry be me. I'm no ori bi me. Iye ori bi me. Oya wo ko ma e. Ko ma, ko ma, ko ma. Wo ko ma e. Ko ma, ko ma. Si no bi bi e. Wateke ata mo ori bi me. Iye ori bi me. Hallelujah. What a great God. What a great God. We want to have our Thanksgiving. There are people who are giving thanks. We have in our midst the people who celebrated their March birthday. In our leadership, we have Sister Dango. Who else do we have in our leadership? Ah, Sister Kemi, Sister hmm? Florence Enzi. So these are the people giving thanks. If you know them, please take a seat and come and dance with them. Then in the pastorate, we have two major pastors. We have Pastor F. Alpha Eligu. And we have Pastor Biobele Arasa on Friday. Wow, it's going to be powerful. <laughs> and guess what? my own son's birthday it was the first time i became a mother some 24 years ago it's going to be this march too this march this march me too i became mother they called me mommy for the first time hey this kind god i never seen type so if you are born in march take a seat and let your friends, if you know Pastor Offa, please join her and thank God. If you know Pastor Biobele, join her and thank God. Adango. <laughs> Biobele, see where Pastor Offa is going to dance from. Go there. <laughs> Hallelujah. There's a song in my spirit I want to sing. Then from there you can change it, yeah? <laughs> Come and join me, sing Hallelujah. I'm a man, 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 I'm a
celebrating your wedding anniversary let me see your hands a new car a new baby hey a graduation an admission hey this kind god do i never see your type go this kind god do this kind God, oh, this kind God, oh, me and never see your time, never oh. see your time, oh. This kind God, oh, this kind God, oh, blessed be your name, blessed be your holy name. I say this kind God, oh, this kind God, oh, I never see your time, oh, I never see your time, oh. This kind God, oh, this kind God, oh. Bless her be your holy name. You don't know what to say. You turn my sorrow into dance. You turn my bitterness to joy. You made a body to keep children. Hey, bless her be your holy name. This kind God, this kind God, let's be your name, let's be your holy name. Don't mean you should not wear that. Say it all. Hallelujah. Somebody make your boast in the Lord. Make your boast in the Lord. Do you know that there are three people here, three of you? This match would have been your last time on planet Earth. But God gave you another chance. And the plan of the devil was not only to take you, was to take you and your family members. But God said no. Mercy said no. We are here to celebrate life. God has done it again. We are grateful. Thank you, Abba Father. Blessed be your holy name. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you for those that are celebrating birthdays. We thank you for those that are celebrating anniversaries, celebrating life, celebrating the year that they gave their life to Christ. Father, we say thank you. Those that are celebrating their new homes, new cars, new degrees, Lord Jehovah, children, we say thank you. Daddy, for me, for the first time in my life, I became a mother. Hey! Lord, I am grateful. If all my body was full of mouths, it would not be enough to say thank you. You have done me well. You have done me well. You have done WWP well. Two of their pastors, Pastor Offa and Pastor Biobele, celebrating their birthdays. It's another time of the year to say thank you. Thank you Lord. Daddy, we are grateful. Daddy, thank you. Daddy, thank you. Thank you, O oh God, for the leaders. The leaders that are celebrating their birthdays for Adango, for Florence, Lord, for Kemi, and for all the people celebrating their birthdays here. Yeah, I see them inside here. Lord will say thank you. Daddy, blessed be your holy name. In the name of Jesus. Daddy, we give you glory. We give you honor. We give you adoration. It was not the time to mark their deaths, but to mark their births. Lord will say thank you. Be thou exalted forever. And I pray for you today that as you are celebrating a new season, the Lord give you a new song. In the name of Jesus, the Lord give you a new dance step. In the name of Jesus, the Lord open a new season for you. It shall be a new season. A season of celebration. A season of miracles. A season of testimonies. A season of joy. In the name of Jesus, it will be a season of new levels. In the name of Jesus, new opportunities, new friendship. In the name of Jesus, new encounters. In the name of Jesus, cover you with the power that is in the blood of Jesus. There will be no counter attacks. In the name of Jesus, we come against.
backlashes in the name of Jesus. Every regrouping of the enemy, we arrest in the name of Jesus. I pray for you from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet. The Lord bless you in the name of Jesus. Those of you celebrating your wedding anniversaries, you will enjoy joy. Your marriage will be a well-watered garden. Ah, it will be a season of love. Your love is renewed. Your children are oaks of righteousness. We soak your children in the blood of Jesus. Soak your marriage in the blood of Jesus. Decree that you will enjoy your children. You will enjoy the fruit of your labor. They will not do one minute silent for you. In the name of Jesus, you will see them on their wedding day. You will carry their children. In the mighty name of Jesus, I decree that it is well with you. I dedicate your cars, I dedicate your house in the name of God the Father, in the name of God the Son, in the power of the Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus. I dedicate even your degrees in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Abba Father. And blessed be your holy name forever and ever. In Jesus' name we have prayed. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I just have a space for one or two people who want to give special thanks. One or two people. Can you come quickly? Come, just come, just dance to the altar quickly. Come on, hey! Tamira Jehovah. Tamira Jehovah. Hey! Tamira
thanking God. Yes, my darling. Bring microphone. Just one, one, one word. One, one word. Last week, mommy said we should dance. Finally, I was dancing like a mad person here. When we got home, somebody called us. We've been expecting a property, mommy, like I told you. Mm. And then the man said to my husband, he said, you don't need to pay. Hey, You don't need to, do, to pay for this property. Go ahead and use it. I have paid. As long as you want to use it. That's it. Somebody scream! Hallelujah! After the prayers here yesterday, I was very stretched out, but I kept on dancing. When I got home yesterday night, an admission we've been expecting for my firstborn son, it came in with scholarship! It came! With scholarship! Hey! 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 Why no go dance? Yes, yeah, so why no go dance? Jesus, yeah. You are God. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Yesterday. Praise the Lord. Let's hear this one. Praise the Lord. Yesterday, after the prayers, yes, too. Yesterday, I, I went to church direct. But when I was going home, where I stood to attack, okay, a can just came and marched to my leg. As in, people said, go and massage you this, but I see my leg. Now, nothing happened to me. I'm still here standing. Hey! When I was coming for fellowship this morning, the vehicle I entered, fair break. Yes. The vehicle I entered, I don't know how the driver did it. He was just ready to I said, Father, you know I'm going to your house to say. That's how we were just doing. But God delivered us. Hallelujah. Do you see why you should thank God? Give it to Kemi. Say hey. After Kemi. Hallelujah. I'm thanking God for life. That uh, we are alive. Mm -hmm. I lost my mother-in-law on Saturday at 86 years old. 86. Thank God that she didn't bury any because she has buried two before. We thank God that she passed on and she rested in the Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank Best daddy in the whole wide world. And I love you. Hallelujah. No, the sister, sister Gold, sister Gold, the hand. Then, mm -hmm. praise God. You know, some time ago I came to testify that I, I sowed a seed for my sister. Wait, Papa, Mommy, you said, sorry, we should sow a seed for our sisters that, that want to get married. And she got married, God gave her a dream husband. Do you know she got A pregnant? dream husband. Do you know she got pregnant that same day? She just gave birth this month. One month after, uh, that's nine, one month to their nine months. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Nine months of their wedding, like a day after the nine months, she had a baby boy. Jesus, yeah. The last my husband must prosper, I connected my sister's husband. Each time there is promotion in the office, they will skip him. And he's, he, he, they bring people lower than him. And he's the one that will still teach those people what to do. So this last my husband must prosper, I told him to join. And when mommy was anointing, I called him on video call. And mommy anointed the phone. Yes, yes. On Monday. On Monday. On Monday morning miracle. He resumed as a manager. Oh. Hey. Hey, 
hey, hey, hey, hey, hey. Okay, just once. Uh, hallelujah. I came here to say thank you to Jesus. Because on the 12th of this month was my seventh anniversary in Christ. Hallelujah. And I'm the only one, and I'm the only one in the family. But I thank God today because we are three now. Hallelujah. And one of them got married last week Saturday. Hallelujah. Your own is coming. Let's let's hear from her. Let's hear from her, please. Then after that, then Victoria then is finished. Hey. Praise the Lord. I just came to thank God for delivering me once again. I just came back from India for my annual PET scan. When I was going, it was not looking like it because before then I was very sick. But I went and did the scan and everything was okay. I've returned to say thank you to Jesus. She's cancer free. Anybody want to be cancer free? Shout or wherever you are. Okay, let's hear this baby. Mm -hmm. Praise, praise, praise the Lord. Ha, ha, hallelujah. I want to thank God that nothing happened to me from crutch till now. I'm in basic five. Hallelujah. Five now. I'm in primary five now, and I'm thanking God that nothing happened to me. They didn't rush me to the hospital. And she's in primary five now. How I many of you want to pass primary hundred? <laughs> Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I come to thank God for mommy. God call, call you. God call you. It's outside. It's outside. Listen, no, oh, listen. I got you. You don't want to open shop. Let me come and dedicate. Yes. Then, 20th of March 2024. Hey. To God be the glory. We back to our new house. Hey! Hey! hey. you today that only thanksgiving will come out of your mouth this thing that you have thanked god for you will not cry over in the name of jesus your dance will not suddenly stop your dance will continue dance will meet dance testimony will meet testimony in the mighty name of jesus i cover these testimonies with the blood of jesus i decree that by this time next month you are coming to thank god again you are coming to thank God for more things that he has added to you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you, Abba Father. And blessed be your holy name forever. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Say the Kalmango dia. Babunda Sanga O Mataya Yesu. Say the Kalmango. We're going to have an Easter outreach. There's going to be an Easter outreach on Thursday. Outreach people, when is it on Thursday? 
Outreach, outreach, outreach. On Thursday, it's an in in rich outreach. And so we'll be, we'll be having it here, and they will be telling your leaders. I think your leaders will give you a stamp to come. Hallelujah. You know that the outreach, many people are hungry, many people are all that. And so we are, we are, I'm looking for 100 women that will give 10,000 and 20,000. Please come, let's give for that outreach. If you, are, if you can give 20, come. If you can give 10, come. 100 of you, please. Start coming, start coming. Say the call Mangodia. Say the call Mangodia. If you can join with somebody, 5-5, five, five, come. What are they sitting there? Oh, say the call Mangodia. Say the call Mangodia. Change the song. Hallelujah. I'm waiting for 10 more people to complete us. 10 more people. I like the way some people are coming. Very excited. Very excited. Do you know that as you come out to give this money, you can never be hungry? I'm telling you, mark my words. Never. This is the way you will celebrate your Easter. So I'm waiting for 10 more people. I've seen two people. Are, are you joining? Are you joining? Then join well. Two, three, four, five. Toby, are you joining? God bless you. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. God bless you. God bless you. Please, if your capacity is 20, don't give 10. If your capacity is 10, don't give 5. Is that okay? And if your capacity, you're here, your capacity is 100, please give. Just give. Because um, we want to bless people. We want to bless people. Those of you who want to witness it, come. Those of you who are in need, come. The, 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 the outreach is supposed to tell us how it will be. I don't know. Come and tell us how it will be. Outreach people. Father Lord, please lift up your two hands like this. Father Lord, these ones have given. The Bible says those that remember the poor, they lend to God. Who are we that we will lend to God? Who are we that we will lend to God? Ah, Jesus. Father, we give you glory. We have come. We have recognized the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. And we have come. This is our way of saying thank you, Lord. 
remembering those that are in need. And Lord, as we remember those in need, we will never be needy. The Bible says it is more blessed to give than to receive. Therefore, I release a blessing over you, over your husband, over your children. In the name of Jesus. That anywhere you go to, you carry the blessing. In the name of Jesus, you will be recognized as the blessed. In the name of Jesus, may the Lord honor you. May the Lord remember you. May the Lord give you your own heart desire. In the name of Jesus, by this time on Tuesday, may testimony be in your mouth. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Abba Father. And blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' precious name we have prayed. God bless you. Have a beautiful Easter. Happy Easter. Yes, my dear. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the outreach says it's according to department by department. Please, this is not the time for leaders to doll in, eh? Don't do sending names, and then it's going to be for first come, first serve. So if you come late and it's finished, but you didn't give us the timing, outreach. Outreach, you didn't give us the timing. 8 a.m. Thursday, we are praying here by 9:12. Uh -huh. It's better. 10 is good. 10 is fine. Yeah, 10 is fine. Hallelujah. So if you want to witness it too, you can come. If you have a bag of rice to give, you can come. If you have a bag of chicken, you can come. If you have something in your house that you want to share, please make sure you share. God bless you. Hallelujah. All right, let the announcement come. Remember, on Monday is first. On Monday, um, Easter Monday is first of April. It's not April Fool. Is that okay? It's not April Fool. It's first of April. We're going to be meeting here at 8 a.m. 8 a.m. for our trumpet service. So I'll be waiting here to pray with you for the month of April. If you don't mind, the month of April, then on Tuesday will be our communion service. Please don't miss the communion service. Is that okay? Why are you not answering? Is it because of... Hallelujah. God bless you. Have a wonderful Easter. Hello and welcome, our first timers and online viewers. Thank you for joining us. This is When Women Pray International, also known as WWP for short. Our vision is to raise a generation of women who are hungry for God, spiritually alert, and conscious of their spirituality in their spheres of contact. These are women who are intentional in their Christian work with God and so practice what they profess as Christians. Our core values are God's Word, forgive quickly, no gossip, love, and patience. This is the flagship center. The president and founder of this ministry is Apostle O.P. Aga the resident pastor of the flagship center, regional pastor Nath, and pastor in charge of diaspora as Pastor I.B. Shegun Agoye. The assistant resident pastor flagship center is Pastor B.B. Arasa. Our prayer coordinator is our own dear pastor, Ofa Elaigu. The pastor in charge of media is our diligent pastor, Uloma Chuku. The regional pastor for Southwest and the resident pastor of Lagos, our Bethel Center, is Pastor Temilade Zurike. The regional pastor for South South, Southeast, and resident pastor Port Harcourt is Pastor Stella Chikwere. We have numerous chapters in Nigeria and so many in diaspora. Kindly visit our website www.whenwomenpray.org for further details and to locate a WWP center close to you and begin to fellowship with us. We have two services every Tuesday by 8 a.m. and 9 a.m. 8 a.m. is the prayer service and 9 a.m. our main service. Every first Tuesday of the month is our communion service. Every third Tuesday of the month is our Bible study 
pink t-shirt Tuesday. Every last Tuesday of the month is our Thanksgiving service. Kindly invite your friends and neighbors to have a new worship experience with God in any WWP center worldwide every Tuesday. Join thousands of people all over the world to experience the touch of God every Thursday by 12 noon for an online prayer hour with Apostle OP. Join us every Friday by 12 noon for Change Live Talk with Apostle OP to hear amazing and miraculous stories of changed lives from our sisters and prepare to be the next to share your testimony. Our account details are When Women Pray International Ministry, Zenith Bank, account number 101-321-3917. Kindly make your online transfer for offerings and partnership. Beware of scam pages of Apostle OP and WWP and do not accept any friend requests from them. Thank you for listening. God bless you.